founded from a place of love. Kira's Closet was created by a grieving Mead mother who lost her young daughter to brain cancer. And in four years, Kira's Closet has helped thousands of families by providing clothing, books, and school supplies. Next month, Kira's Closet is reopening in a new location for their biggest event of the year, Back to School. KXY 4's Katie Curry working for you with how your donation helps more than the people on the receiving end. Tucked away in an old classroom at the former Mead Middle School, sits the new workroom for Kira's Closet. Look at this. As volunteers sort through donations, all around the room, small reminders of 12-year-old Kira Rasper. She was just your happy, healthy, busy girl. She did dance, she was in volleyball, she did um, girl scouting. One Tuesday morning in 2010, Kira woke up complaining her head hurt. And there was something in my head that I don't know if, if it was the voice of God or what it was, but it was, we need help, we need help, we need help. Scans revealed Kira had a hemorrhaging tumor in the middle of her brain. Her brain just started swelling and she was gone on Sunday. Today, in these racks of clothing, piles of books, and tubs full of shoes, Kira's spirit lives on. I think, I, I like to think she's smiling down on us. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, I, I think, to me, I needed to do something. It's, it's a big loss, and, um, and we have a whole army of people that just wanted to help us, so it really does give as purpose as we go along and open on the third Saturday of every month Kira's closet helps out 200 kids a month ranging in ages from infant to late teens when I look at our donations I just think what a great community we have that supports us so when we did start out we were very small and and we've continued to grow I think our first time that we were open we had 28 kids we were so excited and and last August, we had 510 for back to school. The next back to school event is August 15th from 10 to 1. Students have to be with their parents to get a backpack and school supplies. In Mead, Katie Curry, KXLY4 News.